on a big outdoor adventure today. I'm going on an African safari. Just doing the final checks to my Jeep. See, look, it's got an open top so I can see all the wonderful animals and sights around me. Okay, I've got my binoculars as well so I can see things far away. <laughs> and I've got my hat, my water bottle, because it gets pretty hot in Africa, and my lunchbox. Well, I could get hungry. Okay, well, I think that's about it. Step into the Jeep. And off we go. I'm off, I'm off on an African safari. I travel over wide dry plains. Wonderful animals everywhere. And waterholes they stand and stare. A bumpy 
tracks through dust they run that they play under the African sun. I'm up, I'm up on an African safari. Would you like to come? Gee whiz, it's getting pretty hot. I think I need some water. Uh, there we go. Oh, look, quick, get my binoculars. Uh, wow, it, it looks like a horse, but it's got big black and white stripes all over its body. I, I think it's a zebra. All right. Let's see if we can find anything else. Over here. <laughs> binoculars up. Oh, wow, there's another animal. And it's got a really long neck and yellowy brownie patches all over its body. And it's really tall. I think, I think it's a giraffe. <laughs> all right. Well, we better keep driving over the plains. I'm up, I'm up on an African safari. I travel over wild dry plains. Wonderful animals everywhere. Water holes, they stand and stare On bumpy tracks, the fields they run They play under the African sun I'm up, I'm up on an African safari Would you like to come? Quick, get my binoculars! Oh wow! Look at that! It's, it's big and grey and has big flappy ears And a long bendy trunk it's an elephant, and it's coming my way. All right. <laughs> well, these African safaris are amazing. But I'll tell you what, I'm getting kind of hungry. Better find a shady tree and have a bite to eat. <laughs> ah, there's one. Excellent. This looks like a nice spot. Going on an African safari makes you really hungry. <laughs> Yikes! A snake! Gee, you have to be brave being on an African safari, even a pretend one! Come on, guys. Let's see if we can find a giraffe or a zebra. Is it over there? Can you see it? It's over there. Wait. Look, look, look. Is it a zebra? Oh, there's the giraffe in there. Ah, oh, there he is. He's pretty. He's greedy. You know what? <laughs> I saw two giraffes. Did you? What were they yeah. doing? Um, we'll put their heads up. Get the spots on the giraffe. Yeah. He's got long legs. You see them? Look, 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 I'm going bushwalking, looking for some animals that Kelly told me about. Now, Kelly said she saw a hummingbird. Hmm. No hummingbird. But a hummingbird would be flying, so I should be looking up. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking all around. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking up, I'm looking round. Until it's found. No hummingbird. But if I want to see a cassowary, I've got to look on the ground because they don't fly. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking all around. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking low, I'm looking round. Real low, here and there, everywhere, until it's found. <gasps> Whoa! I think I saw a ringtail possum. Why? Should we touch him? Oh, he's spiky, isn't he? There's our friend Spike. Spike the echidna. Spike the echidna. It's eating. Maybe it's eating for ants. Come on, guys, let's go find something else. Come on. Oh, hello. Hello. It's moving. It's moving. Should we gently pat him? I never touched a kangaroo before. No, I've yet. never touched a kangaroo ever. He's beautiful. Oh, he's going to kiss you. Hi, bye. bye. Wow, <laughs> I'm the 
ranger on the scene, looking after wildlife. I'm Ranger Kathleen. 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 I'm the koala's friend, helping plants to mend. I'm looking after everything green. Green. What's her name? Ranger. Ranger Kathleen. Ranger Kathleen outside on patrol in the National Park. And I'm using all my toys as the animals in the park. You know, when you're a ranger, it's important to greet the animals, you know, when you're on a patrol. Ah, hello there, koala. How's it hopping, kangaroo? Ah, you're looking good, elephant. Elephant? In an Australian National Park? Well, that's very strange. Zop, <laughs> zop! <laughs> a blanket? Well, where did this come from? Huh. Oh. oh, well, how did a blanket fall out of this tree? Oh, well, I might as well just lay it down so I can sit on it later when I take a well-deserved break. I'm the ranger on the scene, looking after wildlife. I'm Ranger Kathleen. Kathleen, Kathleen. I'm the koala's friend, helping plants to mend. I'm looking after everything green. green. Green, what's her name? Ranger, Ranger Kathleen. <laughs> oh. Oh. All this rubbish. You know, an important job for the ranger is keeping the park clean. Wait a minute. Well, this isn't rubbish. Well, these juices aren't opened and... Oh, these plates are clean. Maybe somebody dropped them here by mistake. Oh, well, I'll just pop them onto the blanket for now. One. Uh, two, three, four, five plates. And one, two, three, four, five juices. Chop, chop. And a basket of fruit. Well, you know, with these plates, juices and fruit, I think I've got enough things here for a picnic. Oh, OK. One for koala, one for elephant, and one for kangaroo. There, there and there. Oh, and one for me. Oh, and there's one extra. I think I'll just put that over there. I'm the ranger on the scene, looking after wildlife. I'm Ranger Kathleen. I'm the koala's friend, helping plants to mend. I'm looking after everything green. Green, green, what's her name? Ranger, Ranger Kathleen. There, now I can have a picnic with all my friends. Mm -mm. Where's the ranger? Oh. Ah. <coughs> Hello, base. <coughs> It's Ranger Kathleen here, signing off and taking a break. Over and out. Mm -mm. Ah, picnic! <laughs> Ranger Kathleen reporting for duty. OK, Rangers, let's look for all those animals. Come on. Let's look up in the trees for some koalas. I think I can see one. Can you see one? I can. <gasps> OK, guys, let's go find a koala. Good idea. Come, Come on. on, guys. OK, Rangers, I think we found our koalas. Let's have a look. Yeah. Hey, little monkey. I think we're going back to sleep. Oh, are they? Shh. The koalas sleeping. All koalas sleep in the day. They all sleep in the day. This one does. Maybe they wake up in the night. Oh, he's waking up. High, High five! five. I've had a great idea. I want to go somewhere today, but somewhere inside my imagination. That's a great idea, Kel, but where will we go? Well, maybe we could go to an aquarium and visit some fish. I imagine that will be fantastic fun. Just a minute, Kel. Oh. <laughs> cool. OK, well, let's imagine an aquarium right here all around us. Wow! Now let's imagine some fantastic fish floating by. OK. In your imagination, 
looking fish. I don't want that feisty barracuda in my fish fantasy. No. <laughs> oh, look at that funny fish. It looks like it's got whiskers. <laughs> it's a catfish. Hey, where did all the fish go? I think they followed that funny fat catfish. I'd like to see some colourful fish now. OK, let's imagine lots of colourful fish swimming by. Come along and see this fabulous fun fish fantasy. Big fish, small fish, thin and fat. One like an angel, one like a cat. Friendly fish, fantastic fish, fluorescent pink and green. All the colors of the rainbow right here for us to see. Wow, I've never seen so many fabulous colors. Yeah, I like those shiny fluorescent fish. Mmm, I find them fascinating. Shiny fish look like they glow in the dark. Yeah, imagine what they look like in the sea at night. Fabulous, like a fishy light swimming around. Hmm. Look at that friendly angel fish. He looks very friendly. I think it wants to say hello. Hello, angel fish. No, you have to say hello in fish talk, Cal. Fish talk? What's that? First you do a fish face. Now flap your fins. Fantastic fish face, Cal. I'm a funny fish. How about a funny fish kiss? <laughs> yeah, fishy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't splash. Jimmy, splash. Jimmy, splash. Come in the water. Splash. And you. In the sea, I glide through the water easily. I'm a little bit silly and playful as can be. Boo! But for some strange reason, fish aren't scared of me. These fish just don't get it. I'm supposed to be scaring them. Oh, I'll have another go. I'm a shark, I'm a shark. I live in the sea. I glide through the water easily. I'm a little bit But for some strange reason, fish aren't scared of me. For some strange reason, fish aren't scared of me. <sighs> well, I might not be a scary shark, but I'm funny. Yeah! <laughs> okay, guys, what do you think? Yeah. Yeah, you like that? <laughs> okay, who wants the pink wig? Me! Oh, Cara, okay. Ready? Beautiful. Now, who gets the green wig? Oh, you look beautiful. <laughs> there you go, Angie. I'm being my favourite dinosaur today, a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Yeah, really loud T-Rex. Hmm. I wonder, what sort of music would a T-Rex have liked? Because, yeah, if I was a T-Rex living a long time ago, what would I use to make music? Because Tim the T-Rex would have loved music. <laughs> oh, yeah. I definitely would have used this. See? Bone tapping sticks. <laughs> oh, wow. 
and these old eggshells would make great bongo drums. I'm a romping, stomping, crashing, bashing, music making T Rex, and I'm up so high, about as high as I can be. I'm a romping, stomping, crashing, bashing, music making T Rex, and there's no one else as loud as me. Roar! <sighs> oh, yeah, look! A great big mammoth horn! Ah! <sighs> Yeah, this would be a great horn. Oh, yeah. A gigantic leaf pod shaker. Yeah. Boy, there's a lot of things around here for making music. Yeah. Tim the T-Rex sure is lucky to find all these instruments. Roar! <laughs> wow. A herd of Brachiosaurus. <laughs> It's a Brachiosaurus chorus. Do you guys want to sing with me? <laughs> I'm a romping, stomping, crashing, bashing, music making T Rex. And I'm up so high, about as high as he can be. I'm a romping, stomping, crashing, bashing, music making T Rex. And there's no one else as loud as him. Hmm, mm. you know. All this singing is making me hungry. Ah, <laughs> uh, thanks, Brachiosaurus. Stomping dinosaurs. Rawr! Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Molly. Every single night, Molly went somewhere special, her own special place. It's here. It's my bed. It's big. It's safe, and it's comfy. Isn't it great? Now, Molly's bed was extra special because every night when she was asleep, something wonderful happened. That's right. I have the best dream. You see, I dream that my bed is a boat and I'm sailing down a river in a jungle. Watch me sail, watch me float down a deep jungle stream. While Molly was floating in her bedboat, she met all sorts of exciting creatures. Oh, hello there. Lovely night for a sail. Hello, who are you? I'm Big Henry, the hippopotamus. Oh. Very tired looking hippo by the looks of things. Oh, I'll say. I didn't sleep a wink last night. The noise in this jungle was ridiculous. Well, I just happen to have some very special hippopotamus earmuffs. They'll help you sleep in peace and quiet. Gee, thanks. Oh, and by the way, if you're heading downstream, be careful of the waterfall. It's just past the rocky rapids. Thanks, Henry. See you later. Oh, would you like a ride down the river? That'd be great. Hop on. Just around the next bend in the river, who should Molly meet up with but a brilliantly coloured bird? Oh, squawk! Oh. Oh, I'm a toucan. I'm just here enjoying the beautiful breeze. Isn't it wonderful? Mm. Oh, might blow away some of those yucky jungle smells. Oh, and you should have got a whiff of what some of those monkeys left behind. P.U. Stinky <laughs> ass. Squawk! Squawk! Oh, I think I just did. <laughs> oh, now watch out for the waterfall. It's just past the rocky rapids. It can be very dangerous. Squawk! Okay, thanks, Squawk! toucan. Oh, toucan, would you like a ride down the river? Mm -hmm. Hop on. Just at that moment, an amazing thing happened. Swinging on a vine out across the river came... Oh! Hello, I'm Juju the Jungle Girl at 
your service. And I'm here to help you steer safely across the waterfall that's right in front of us. Here we go! Oh, no! Oh. Oh. Thanks for coming with me. Same time tomorrow night, same place, same river. And that's just what Molly did the very next night. She dreamed of visiting her special jungle friends on the river. Hey everyone, let's paddle over for another song. outside today. So, we're going to the beach. Woohoo! <laughs> I have my beach towel and my beach ball. I love how you can scrunch a beach ball up. And when you go to the beach, you blow it up just like this. <laughs> Tim! Yeah? Hey, can you blow this up for me, mate? Thanks. I want to practice something else at the beach today. My surfing. Let's go, let's go on a surfing safari. Jump on the board with my arms out wide. Whoa, 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 it's a seven safari. Here comes a wave, let's go for a ride. Whoa, 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 yeah, seven safari. Whoa, 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 yeah, I'm catching the tide. Let's go, let's go on a seven safari. <laughs> There's so many ways you can surf. Hey, I can put these flippers on. Okay. <laughs> They're tricky to put on. One. Two, and I can swim out, catch a wave, and body surf in. All right. Funny shaped things, these flippers, aren't they? Yeah. And they're even tricky to walk in. Flip, flap, flip, flap, flip, flap. I better take them off. There. Oh, look at this. Now, this is Kelly's surfboard. Pretty big, isn't it? Okay, right, jump on the board. Okay, swim out, try and catch a wave. All right, 
Here comes a wave. I'm going to try and stand up. Oh, <laughs> I lost it. All right, here comes another wave. It's a bit tricky, standing up. Here we go. I'm up. I'm up. Whoa. I'm down. <laughs> hey, that was fun. Hi, Nathan. Hi, Nathan. <laughs> hey, guys. Wow, it's changed shape from a small flat thing to a big round beach ball. <laughs> hey, um, Nathan, how's your surfing going? Oh, I think I need lots more practice. All right, well, let's have one more practice and we'll be off. All right. Woo! Let's go, let's go on a surfing safari. Jump on the board and my arms out wide. Whoa, 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 it's a surfing safari. Here comes a wave, let's go for a ride. Whoa, 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 yeah, surfing safari. Whoa, 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 yeah, catching the tide. Let's go, let's go on a surfing safari. Oh, 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 wiper! I'm making a special place right here in my space. In here I can pretend to be anywhere I like. Well today I'm at the beach, a special indoor beach. <sighs> you know what? I feel like a cool drink. Well that's the best thing about my special indoor beach. I've got everything I need right here. Towel's gone. Let's see. Oh no, it's not in there. Well, how am I supposed to have a special indoor beach without a beach towel? <laughs> hey! Well, what's this? Well, it's not a beach towel, but it is a great colour. Blue. Like the water in the sea. Well, I could use this material to make the sea for my indoor beach. Excellent. Okay, so I could make a curving, wavy pattern, like the waves in the sea. Excellent. Now, what else does my beach need? Mm, sand. Okay, well, what could I use for sand? Oh, excellent. Yellow wrapping paper. Put it down here, unroll it to make a long strip of yellow sand in my wavy blue sea. There. Wow, my indoor beach is starting to look excellent. <laughs> hey, who's making a mess on my beach? Huh. Let's see. Ovals and triangles. Well, they don't belong on a beach. <laughs> oh, I know. Inside I have a special place, it's my special space, my special space. And in my space I can be anywhere, on land or sea or in the air. And in my space I can be anywhere. Ta-da! <laughs> little fish swimming in the sea. Hmm, you know what? I think I'll have a little lie down <laughs> on my indoor beach. See you later. Hey, what are we going to make? A face. A face. Now, what do we need for a face? Hair! Hair! Hair. Where's the hair? Yeah. Mouth. What else do we need? An eye over here. A moustache. A moustache. An eye. No. Ah, 
Now this is the life. Nice campfire, some bush tucker. <laughs> Nothing but peace and quiet in the great outdoors. Mm. Boy, I like the sound of that wind rushing through the trees. Mm. Almost sounds a bit like music. I hear the music of the earth whispering, talking to you. Hear a sound singing softly in your ears I hear the wind whispering through the leaves of the trees Making sounds of music, making a song for me Hey, can you hear that sound? It's kind of a thumping sound There's another sound. It's coming from the bush. It's getting closer. Oh, it's a kangaroo! <laughs> jump, 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 boing, boing, boing. <laughs> Hear the music of the earth whispering, talking to you. Hear a sound singing softly in your ears I hear the wind whispering through the leaves of the trees Making sounds of music, making a song for me <laughs> oh. Hear that? Another sound from the bush Mopoke, mopoke, mopoke. Oh, wow, it's a mopoke owl. I wonder if I can make that sound with this. Mopoke, mopoke. <laughs> mopoke, mopoke. Hear the music of the earth whispering, talking to you. Hear a sound singing softly in your ears. Mopoke, I hear the wind whispering through the leaves of the trees. Mopoke, Making sounds of music, making a song for me. Mopoke, mopoke. Whew, boy. It's a lot of animals making a lot of noise in the bush. Maybe I should try and get some sleep. Uh, lucky I don't make any noise. I bet you we find more than the boys. You guys find any? I think there's a few more around. There's some over here. You got that one? Excellent. Okay, you keep walking. Hey, hey. It's gonna be good fire. Been waiting for this fire all week. Yeah, me too. I can't wait. It's going to be fun. That's it. It's done. Yeah. Yummy. Yummy. <laughs> okay. Boing, 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 boing. <laughs> I'm a big red kangaroo hopping around in the bush. And I've got a little joey in my pouch. I'm a kangaroo, a big red roo. A joey in my pouch, and it's just new. A kangaroo, a big red roo. And everywhere I go, my joey goes too. I might take a rest on my big, strong kangaroo tail. How are you going in the pouch there, little Joey? Not too bouncy for you? <laughs> OK, let's do some more bounding about. I'm a kangaroo, a big red roo, a Joey in my pouch, and it's just new. A kangaroo, a big red roo, and everywhere I go, my Joey goes too. Boing, 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 boing. Oh, he's standing still. Mm, tasty crust. Thanks. Thanks. 
Here he comes up again. a canoe through crocodile country in the Australian outback. We're looking for cunning crocodiles. Yes, crocodiles are very cunning, aren't they, Chats? Cunning and clever. Actually, Chats, we're looking for one particular crocodile today. And this part of her river is her home. Crocodile, crocodile, where can you be? Creeping through the undergrowth, looking up at me. Crocodile, crocodile, where can you be? Crawling down the river bank, smiling up at me. Do you think that crocodile's really around here, Kelly Crocodile Watcher? Absolutely, Chats. That's why we stay safely inside our canoe. That clever crocodile's probably crawling quite close. Look, Chats, over there on the river bank. It's the crocodile. Isn't she beautiful? She's beautiful, all right, but she's got big teeth. Oh, did you know that crocodiles are carnivorous? Doesn't that mean they like eating meat? Sure does, Chats. Well, I hope she's had her breakfast then. <laughs> it's okay, Chats. We're safe inside our strong canoe. I'm going to paddle carefully past and take a closer look. Mm. Be careful, Cal. All right. Crocodile, crocodile, where can you be? Creeping through the undergrowth, smiling up at me. Of me, right there on the riverbank, smiling gleefully. I think we're close enough. Hello, crocodile. Mmm. You know she's pretty long, isn't she? Say at least two meters. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Wow. We don't want to bother her. I think I might paddle a bit further away. Yeah, I think she's a real cranky croc. Well, this is her home on the river, Chats. Maybe we better go then. Chats, where's the crocodile gone? Where's she gone? Oh, look, Chats, over there. Oh, and she's got two little baby crocs. Yeah, well, we're not going to go anywhere near them. Oh, you know, that's probably why our croc was cranky, because she's protecting her babies. <laughs> they look like little cranky crocs, too. <laughs> is it time to be on our way, Cal? It sure is, Chats. OK. Bye-bye, crocodile. See you in a while, crocodile. <laughs> <laughs> an explorer called Captain Wacko. He was a very silly person. Wacko by name, Wacko by nature. Now Captain Wacko had come up with a wonderfully silly idea. Yes, I'm going to lead an expedition, a silly walk to reach the silliest town in Australia. Mark my words, it's going to be very, very silly. I love being silly, I love acting mad. It's great being wacko, it's the best fun that I've had. Ooh. Captain Wacko decided to take his best friend Silly Billy on his trip. Hello, Captain Wacko! Hello, Silly Billy! <laughs> you ready for our silly expedition? Hey, why are you wearing a raincoat on such a sunny day? Because it's a silly thing to do! Oh, yeah. 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 We love being silly! silly. Now they began their silly expedition by hopping all the way to the Tickly Nose Ranges while rubbing their heads at the same time. Hey, Silly Billy. Ah. I call this the first leg of our expedition. <laughs> get it? First leg. <laughs> yeah, I get it. That's really silly. <laughs> Along the road they met a kangaroo who thought they were very silly. Ah, you know, it would be a lot quicker if you hopped on two feet like me. Watch. See? Uh, 
I'm sorry. Two feet is nowhere near silly enough for us. Is it, silly Billy? Yeah, no, no, who I hate. Uh. <laughs> oh, look, look. What? He's sneezing, wheezing, mounting. Oh, time to get even sillier. Yeah. yeah. We, we love being silly. silly. We, we love acting mad. It's great being wacko. wacko. It's the best fun that, that we've had. had. Now, Sneezy Weezy Mountain is the 68th highest mountain in the Tickly Nose Ranges, and Captain Wacko had a plan. We are going to sneeze our way to the very top. Come on, silly Billy, start sneezing. And that's exactly what they did. They sneezed non-stop for 14 and a half hours till they reached the very top. Hey. We did it, Silly Billy. We made it to the top of Sneezy Weezy Mountain. Achoo! Achoo! Bless you. Oh, thank you. Finally, the two adventurers had to face their greatest challenge. We have to cartwheel our way all across the Jiggly Jiggly Plain. You ready, Silly Billy? I'm ready as I'll ever be. OK, start cartwheeling. We love being silly. We love acting mad. It's great being wacko. It's the best fun that we've had. Five weeks, four days and 13 hours later, Captain Wacko and Silly Billy finished their silly expedition. By now they were feeling a bit dizzy. Hello, welcome to the silliest town in the whole of Australia. I'm Mayor Silly Sausage, how do you do? How do you? <laughs> I'm the best silly walker in the whole of the town. <laughs> That's the silliest walk I've ever seen. <laughs> Can you teach us? Of course. Let's go round and round and round Town Square. <laughs> Follow me. So Mayor Silly Sausage, Captain Wacko and Silly Billy had a wonderful time laughing and doing silly walks until they all fell over. <laughs> oh, and that's the end of a very silly story. Come on, guys, let's go sing ourselves silly with a song. <laughs> Come out and 